Good afternoon guys and welcome back to the channel. So this is a returning customer that's visiting us with his 2019 uh, Westphalia and Munsden on a Fiat Ducato base. It's what we call a slide door conversion, although the slide doors on the other side. It's a professional setup, but this customer has already had an Alpine seven inch media, digital media um, system fitted, um, but realized then that the factory speakers just lack everything. So what we've done is we've removed the door speakers We've applied stage one sound deadening. We've included some really nice Eaton component speakers, and we've also fitted the subwoofer that goes underneath, which is again, Alpine. Um, the Alpine uh, included amp as well. Ordinarily, we would use the Alpine trio of equipment. So that's your sub, your amp, and your dash mounted um, radial speakers. But the radio speakers are really, really good from Alpine. Don't get me wrong, we love Alpine gear. But in my motorhome, I've got a 2009 coach built and I wanted something better. So I therefore Richard to, got Richard to sound deaden both the doors just to tighten them up, get rid of any plastic wobbles and rattles and vibrations, fit these dedicated Eaton component speakers which we'll show you and have a link on the website anyway because I don't think we've got them on there as yet and yes you will pay more but you're going to get a much better overall sound because you've got your door speakers with speaker rings and and uh, sound deadening then you've got your tweeters up on the a pillars mine are on show whereas this is a facelifted vehicle so we fitted the tweeters behind the a pillars and it sounds amazing anyway jump on the side and we'll show you what we've done So light isn't great and to be honest um, it's very difficult to show you speakers and subwoofer and stuff behind the scenes but also on a camera it's very difficult for you to be sitting in here listening to the quality that we're now listening to and again that's even more difficult because even if we were playing some of our royalty free um, music then that's fine but you're still not going to get the Rode microphone to pick up that quality as much as we want it to. It's really immersive. I mean, you jumping in here uh, and feeling the weight of this Fiat uh, speaker that came out. First of all, it weighs next to nothing. Two, any of you that know about thing about speakers, this little fella here, little magnet on the back there. This is just a you know mass-produced cheap speaker that's probably maybe a pound one pound fifty um, and the Eaton's that we've put in which Matt will show you above anyway uh, will drastically change the way that this system works but in combined with the uh, in conjunction or combined with the Alpine ILX F705D, again picture above. The reason why this customer has come back after having this um, system fitted was just because he wants a bit more um, warmth and depth and clarity. They're my three favorite words I use all the time. Warmth and depth and clarity because you're not gonna get clarity from that. You're gonna be able to hear different instruments now. And with the Alpine subwoofer, which is down here and it sits underneath the drinks holder. It's absolutely amazing because even if you've got a vehicle that doesn't even have a drinks holder like mine did, we can get rid of the glove box, whether it's in gray or black, fit the drinks holder, then fit the subwoofer. And suddenly you've got a, a much more useful area for whatever you wanna put. Most of the time you're gonna put a drink there, but there's also coins and other little storage cubby holes. 
as part of the Alpine subwoofer. Again, Matt will show you above, is the um, little rotary gain volume knob, which starts off at minimum. We always set till about halfway, but you notice immediately the difference. So if you don't want bass, or you've got a headache, or you want more bass, and you wanna turn, want turn it up, you can do. The sound transformation is amazing. So what we have done in this particular vehicle already came to us with the ILX705 seven inch digital media receiver, and we've now given it stage one sound deadening, Eaton six and a half inch door speakers in the door, A-pillar tweeters, which are hidden behind the scenes, and we've gone for a mini amplifier that's hidden behind the drinks holder. You don't have to have the amp, but it gives the whole system a bit of a, a boost as well. But you have got the Class D amplifier in here, 50 watts per channel in conjunction with the 250 watt peak handling um, passive subwoofer from Alpha Alpine and it is absolutely amazing. So if you have got a motorhome or camper van and you want to do some more trips but you're just what no I say worried, worry is a stupid word but if you're frustrated with the lack of decent audio quality for the different genres that you listen to, then get in touch with us. We're here down in Paul in Dorset. Um, this is what we do, we love doing it. And during the video, you would have seen the process in, in how and what we do and why we do it. So that we hand over to this customer in a minute, he's gonna be absolutely chuffed to bits because he knows damn well what this sounds like. Even though we fitted a lovely new Alpine, it's not going to be able to do much for the speakers and now we have transformed that. So don't forget to like, subscribe, tell your friends and family, follow us on social media. Uh, the website is uh, www.motorhomeretrofits.co.uk and thanks again as for watching and uh, we'll keep videoing. Thank you.